Hello everyone and welcome back to TradeSmart. Today's video is going to be an exciting one as I will be sharing a simple trading strategy for Bitcoin that I've developed with the help of ChatGPT. I approached ChatGPT with the idea of creating a trading strategy and after discussing a few options we landed on an interesting one. I then asked ChatGPT to code it into PyScript, the programming language used on TradingView, so I can backtest and optimize the strategy. After some back and forth and a bit of fine tuning, we came up with a practical strategy code. After that, I went ahead and optimized the strategy specifically for the BTC USDT 10 minute chart with a 2.5% risk per trade and a maximum drawdown of 25%. The strategy has outperformed the Bitcoin buy and hold over the last 4 year cycle. Today I will walk you through the strategy's rules, delve into the results more deeply and share the source code with you all for free. But just before that, I have an important announcement to make, so bear with me for a minute. In the coming weeks we will be expanding the TradeSmart YouTube channel. We plan to launch at least two side channels dedicated to specific topics for several reasons. The recent introduction of our new series, the 1k to 10k crypto challenge, which differs significantly from our original content of trading strategy backtesting and trading bot automation, messed up the YouTube algorithm, cutting our average views by half or even more. Therefore we decided to segregate different type of contents to separate channels to keep the algorithm happy. On this main channel we return to our roots, which a lot of you love, posting only the best and often more complex trading strategies we develop. This includes our premium scripts with trading bot automation too. Due to the extensive research and the for these videos require, we will be posting a new video every other week. The first side channel, the Trade Smart Crypto Journey, is already live. We will transfer the entire 1k to 10k crypto series there and continue posting crypto challenge videos exclusively on that channel. As of the release of this video, I have also uploaded a new 1k to 10k crypto challenge video showcasing free airdrop opportunities. So if you are interested in free crypto, be sure to check it out. And for those following the 1k to 10k challenge, make sure you are subscribed to the new Trade Smart Crypto Journey channel. Link will be down in the description. We will be uploading videos there every other week or monthly depending on the crypto market's movement. Our second side channel will focus on simple trading strategy reviews with the use of ChatGPT and AI. Videos like this one, where I code a simple trading strategy with ChatGPT, optimize it and share the source code for free, will be featured on that channel exclusively. On that channel we will be uploading videos every week, so if you are interested in our best trading strategies and in using them as an automated trading bot, be sure to be subscribed to this, the original TradeSmart channel. If you are interested in the 1k to 10k crypto challenge, where we research and invest in the best cryptocurrencies, make sure to subscribe to the TradeSmart Crypto Journey channel. And for those who want to see simple yet profitable strategies generated with ChatGPT and the use of AI, be sure to subscribe to the TradeSmart AI channel. That's all for the announcement for now, I will keep you updated in future videos, but now let's get back to today's video. So, my goal was to use ChatGPT to create a fully functional trading strategy PineScript code, then optimize it to get the best results possible. First, I went over to ChatGPT and asked it to give me trading strategy ideas. Initially, it gave me some pretty basic strategies, but after a while, I got something interesting, which is the volatility squeeze strategy. Next, I asked it to code it into PineScript, so I can visualize, backtest and optimize the strategy on TradingView. It quickly generated the PineScript code, I copied it and pasted it to TradingView. As always, first I got a few errors, so some back and forth began with ChatGPT and after a few messages I got a working script. Now I wanted to add some more functions to the script like ATR based stop loss, different position sizing methods and some visualization. After a few hours of chatting with ChatGPT, I finally got the strategy script I wanted. In the next few days I optimized it to get the best results, so now let me explain how this strategy works, dive into the backtest results and provide you with the free source code. For this strategy, first of all open up TradingView and set up the BTC USDT 10 minute chart. Once you got that, let's set the indicators needed. For this strategy we will only need three different indicators. First the Gartner channel, then the Bollinger Bands and finally the NNFX ATR. To add the indicators, open up the Indicators tab and first type in Bollinger Bands. Add this one to your chart. Next, type in Gartner Channel and add this one. And finally, type in NNFX ATR. 
and click on this one. Okay, now we have our three indicators on the chart, but we need to modify some settings. So first, open up the NFX ATR indicator, which will be our stop loss and take profit indicator. Change the X value, which is the ATR length to 20. Change the TP, which is the take profit target to 15. And the SL, which is the stop loss target to 4. Then switch to the styles tab. Untick the main ATR section as we won't need that. And change the line styles to step line. Next open up the Kartner channel settings. In the input step use my settings, so change the Kartner channel length to 70, the multiplier to 7.5, untick the use exponential MA box, make sure that your band style is average true range, set the ATR length to 20, and then switch to the style step. At the style step I change the upper and lower KC lines to green. Finally, open up the Bollinger Band settings, change its length to 45, make sure its basis MA type is SMA, its source is close, then change the STD dev to 2.5, and that's all. Ok, the strategy consists of these three indicators, but as I mentioned, I coded the full strategy, which includes all these indicators, which you can see on the top here. If I enable it, you will see the backtesting results right here. And as for this strategy, we will only need that full script. Let's hide all the other indicators as I just wanted to show you what we are using. Now let's go over the rules for longs and for shorts. Here we have a valid long entry. The main idea behind this strategy is to enter into a long position after the price was squeezed into a tiny range like this one. And then it broke out. Here you can see all the rules for long entry. First, we need to see the upper Bollinger Band, which is the blue line, above the upper Kartner Channel line, which is the green line. If you take a look at this valid long signal candle, you can see that the upper blue line is above the upper green line. The second and final rule for a valid long entry is that the signal candle needs to open below the upper Kartner Channel line and close above it. As I mentioned earlier, this upper green line is the Kartner Channel line, and the long entry signal candle opened below that green line and closed above it. So this candle is a valid long entry signal. We can enter into a long position at the close of the signal candle or at the open of the next candle. As we are using a strategy script, you can see that the script entered into a long position on the next candle's open. Talking about stop loss and take profit, the stop loss will be placed at a 4 times ATR distance, which is based on the entry signal candle. And if you take a look, here we have a tiny red line, which is basically the stop loss placement. For the take profit, we are using a 15 times ATR distance, which is signaled by this tiny horizontal green line. For the position sizing, after optimizing this strategy, I found that a 2% risk per trade is the sweet spot risk reward wise, so I am using that. And there is one crucial trade management rule with this strategy. If we get another valid long entry, while the current long entry is still open, then every time we will update our stop loss and take profit levels to the new values. As you can see, a valid long entry is signaled by this tiny arrow. And here we get another tiny arrow just like that. So when this valid long entry was printed, I updated the stop loss to the new stop loss level, which is right there. And the take profit to the new take profit level right here. With this strategy, we either have to monitor these updates manually, or use a strategy script which will give us entry and exit signals. Here, while we have still a long position open, we get another new long entry signal. Therefore, our stop loss and take profit gets updated again. Here another one, again stop loss and take profit is updated. Here another one, same goes here. And the last valid entry signal was right here just like or less stop loss and take profit update. And as you can see, the stop loss got hit right here. But of course, that doesn't mean that this trade was a losing one. Let's take a look. We entered into a long position right there where it says long, and we exited the position right here where it says exit long. This was a 10.01% move, or in risk reward wise, 
a 1 to 8 risk to reward ratio trait. Now let's take a look at a short example, then I will go over the backtest for the 10 minute, the 15 minute and the 30 minute as this strategy works on all three. Here we have a valid short entry signal. For a valid short entry, first we need to see that the lower Bollinger band, which is the blue line, is below the lower Keltner channel, which is the green line. Then the candle needs to open above the lower Keltner channel and close below it. Here on this short entry signal, the lower Bollinger Band's blue line was below the lower Keltner channel line. If we zoom in a bit, we can also see that the entry signal candle opened above the lower Keltner channel line and closed below it. So all the requirements are met for a valid short entry and we can enter into a short position on the close of the signal candle or at the open of the next candle. Stop loss will be placed at a 4 times ATR distance, which is signaled with this red line, and the take profit will be at a 15 times ATR distance, which is signaled with this green line. Remember, just like with a long position, if we get a new valid short entry signal, the stop loss at take profit targets will get updated. And just like that, after 3 candles, we get another valid short entry signal, and I updated the stop loss and take profit targets accordingly. As we go on, after a while we got another valid short entry signal, I updated the stop loss and take profits accordingly, and here a last one, and I did the same update again. Finally the last stop loss was hit right here, and again this does not mean that this trade was a losing one. Let's take a look. So the strategy script entered into a short position right here where you can see this red arrow and we exited it right there when it says exit short and as you can see this was a negative 2.58% movement which is in case of a short position is a profitable one. Risk to reward wise this trade was a 1 to 1.57 risk to reward ratio trade. Ok, now let's see the backtest results for the 10 minute, the 15 minute and the 30 minute and after that I will show you how you can get access to the free strategy pine script code. Here you can see the backtest results for the BTC USDT 10 minute chart for the last 4 years. I used the 2.5% risk per trade position sizing with a 0.1% commission rate and a 2 tick slippage. Over the last 4 years, this strategy took 139 trades, generated over 800% net profit with a 1.88 profit factor and with only 25% max drawdown. This drawdown volume might be high for a few of you, and I also prefer a drawdown below 20%, but considering that Bitcoin had a drop of around 80%, I think a 25% is acceptable. Now for those who are interested in the detailed performance summary, here it is. Now let's move on to the 15 minute chart. On the 15 minute I am using the same backtest time interval, I am using the same position sizing, fee rate and so on. Here the strategy is still profitable, but not even close to the 10 minute chart. With 98 trades it generated 57% net profit and did that with a 1.3 profit factor and a 30% maximum drawdown. So I personally wouldn't use this strategy on the 15 minute chart, but it is still profitable on it, which can indicate the strategy's robustness. Lastly, let's see the 30 minute chart. Again I use the same time interval, position sizing and fee rate, and here we got a much better equity curve. After taking 58 trades, it generated 103% net profit, with a 1.9 profit factor and only 18% maximum drawdown. But comparing it to the buy and hold, it is still far off. Now let me tell you more about this script and how you can get access to it. An important note, I will be creating a Google spreadsheet where I will be tracking all of the strategies that I will create with ChatGPT, so you can easily find out which are the best strategies. To that spreadsheet I will also upload a download link where you can download a text containing the whole source code. In the script you can choose from 4 different position sizing methods. If you have any questions of how these position sizings work, ask me in the comment section. For each position sizing here you can set up your desired mounts. Here are the settings for the Keltner channel, the Bollinger bands and the ATR based stop loss. 
So if you want to try out this script, I will post the whole PineScript code of this strategy down in the description and I will pin it in the comment section too. Well, that's a wrap for today's video. If you enjoyed this one, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe to our new channels and turn on the notification bell. As always, thank you all for watching, don't forget to subscribe to our other channels linked down in the description. And if you want to support us so we can keep researching and creating these videos, check out our Patreon and get access to our best premium scripts with trading bot automation, or to the 1k to 10k crypto challenge where I post all my live trades, or portfolio, airdrop opportunities and or extensive 300 coin crypto research spreadsheet. If you want to see another strategy that I created with the ChatGPT and get access to that strategy's free source code, check out this video. Or if you want to see the first gains in the 1k to 10k crypto challenge, check out this video. Until next time, trade smart.